Hello, British Red Cross, Jackie speaking. It's the first time we've worked with the primary care sector. Normally we've worked with acute sectors. Hello, Mrs Shortland. Hello, it's Jackie from the British Red Cross. Hello, how are you? We work with the GPs and community matrons and they alert us for any of their patients that have uh, got issues. We get a first referral. We can act upon it really promptly and we can go within the, the hour. The first visit, his name's John Reed. He was re-referred to us last week by the GP. Um, he's really struggling with his mobility at the moment. Hello. Good morning, Hello. John. Hello. How have you been over the weekend? Uh, not good. Not good? No, In no, what no. way? It's 24-7, you know, the pain. Dreadful. Everybody's yeah. needs are different for the service. It's just they're, they're, they're not. It can generally be yeah. just checking on medication. Uh, better histamine, uh, which is from a vertigo. Making sure yeah. that they've eaten yeah. okay for the day. What have you got plans for your lunch? I wouldn't mind a drink and some toast. Yeah. The British Red Cross help immensely because there are times when I just cannot move. Oh yeah, John. Pop that on there for you. Thank you, my sweet. And some toast. Thank you. And uh, they'll say, well, can I make you a cup of coffee? Can I do this and that and the other? And they will do a shop for me as well, because I can't get out like this. You're kind of just a... You do. ...a number. But the Red Cross, when they come, they... You become friends. You kind of make friends of, of them. You feel you're part of... Um, well, kind of a part of a family. It's always a joy to see them. And they're all very nice people. You take care. Bye. 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 Support we put in can be once a day up to four times a day. Somebody might have intensive support for a few weeks. We're going to see a lady called Gwendolyn Shortland. She's a diabetic and she's had diarrhea and sickness, which made her really weak. Do you often come and sit down here? You can imagine us all in the when we're here, can't you? Yeah. Gwen gets a lot out of the British Red Cross visiting and I think each day that we visit we can see a confidence growing within herself. I remember when I was young we always used to support the Red Cross. Funny, isn't it? That I should have it. It would come to me. We really are saving people being admitted to hospital. I'll leave it to you. And it's very much being that, that good neighbour. I felt that there was someone caring for me and uh, it made a vast difference.